Hey guys, it's Mac, and I am back with another unboxing video for you today. Today is an unexpected unboxing video. We got a gift in the mail today from a friend that I have made recently through the Bambox community. His name is Paul Menix. Um, his YouTube channel is The Peep Geek. You have to check some of his videos out. He has unboxed some of the awesomest things I've ever seen. And I love the guy to death. Just in the one month that I've got to talk to him, he is an awesome person to get to know. Him and Marie Gifford, you guys rock. I love you to death. Thank you so much for the warm welcome into the community. And thank you so much for our care package that we got today. This is a little care package of things that Paul just threw together to help get us started recollecting again. And uh, like I said, I, I can't wait to get into this box. So without further ado, let's get into the box. I'm going to set this over here out of the way. I did cut it open and took the personal information off of it so I didn't flash it to the whole entire world. Um, but I haven't got into it yet. So let's see what's in here. On the top, we got ourselves some packaging paper. Throw that over there to the dog. I'm sure he'll love that. And right on top we got ourselves a comic book. The Walking Dead. That is awesome. The Walking Dead. That is cool. Sorry. Sorry about that. That's cool. I don't have very many comics. Um, but I am a big Walking Dead fan, so I cannot wait to get into this. Thank you so much, Paul. I am going to enjoy that very much. The Walking Dead. Sorry about the glare, guys. The lights are kind of bright in here. And next I see, let's just get the big stuff out of the way. Oh, wow. Oh, Sarah is going to absolutely love this. This is awesome. It is Annabelle from The Conjuring. That is so cool. And very, very morbid. Freaky little chick. <laughs> that is so cool. I would never have a doll like that in my house. No way in hell. Thank you so much, Paul. Sarah is going to love that. Can't wait to show her that. Set that over there. Okay, and next in this big old box of goodies, oh, I've seen this and was hoping I would get this in one of the fire sale boxes that Bam has, but Paul sent it, and I am extremely happy to have it. I know it's just goofy as hell, but this was a big movie that I watched in my childhood. It's the little mini leg lamp from A Christmas Story. That is awesome. We literally just got done putting our Christmas decorations and stuff up in the other office in there. So this is definitely going to go in there on that office table. Thank you so much. That is awesome. All right. This thing is fully loaded. So, <laughs> well, I would love to enjoy these socks, but I'm never going to get to wear them because Sarah takes all the socks. And they are Walking Dead socks. I love the Walking Dead from AMC. That is awesome. And why? Why? Okay. My question is, when they make these socks, is, I'm five foot three. This will go all the way up my thigh. <laughs> but I absolutely love it, and I'm going to wear it until Sarah finds it and steals it from me. Thank you so much for that, man. That is cool. All right, and we got something else here on top. Oh, wristband. Wristband, say. Sorry, let's set that there. Where beauty meets blood. Gorgeous. Where beauty meets blood. So we got a little... Wristband, stress band, what I call it. And we got ourselves a little poster. Oh, that is 
Awesome. Oh, okay. Now I see where the wristband came from. That is awesome. Jason Voorhees. I would tell you the size of this, but I have no idea. But I will take it and find a frame for it. Guarantee you that. That is awesome. <laughs> that is cool. I have to lay it somewhere. Just let it flat it out. Set that over there. All right. And it just keeps going and going, baby. What do we got here? <laughs> uh, I never even told him this. But I collect shot glasses as well. And that is an awesome set of shot glasses. A nightmare on Elm Street set of shot glasses. That is cool. That is awesome. One shot of these. Oh, and they actually say Elm Street on the back. That is awesome. Oh, wow. Okay, so now we're getting into a few smaller pieces here. So I'm going to pull this out. Oh, Lord. Wow. Okay, so let's see what this is. Looks like a little group of stuff here. Pins, pins. Love our pins. <laughs> that is absolutely awesome. Horrifyingly awesome. Chucky, we got Chucky. Oh, I love Chucky. I'm gonna have to open Chucky and take a closer look at Chucky. Just rip right into that. Oh, that is awesome, man. I love the detail in their pens. Their pens are so badass. Excuse my language. I'm not redoing this video, so that's staying. Anyway, thank you so much. October's theme. Cool. I don't share the pens, so I hope there's no pens in here from Mama. She's going to be disappointed. <laughs> and who do we got here? Look, I'm just trying to rip into it. Don't even know who it is yet. So, who do we got? I want you guys to be surprised with me. Who is it? Rick Grimes. We got a bloody Rick Grimes. That is awesome. By Nick Kakuza. That is pat ass. Thank you so much, man. I love these. This is a great way to start our collection. And I know, I'm pretty sure there's probably sets of these. So, now the chaos has started and I have to hunt down the rest of these pins in this set. So, Sarah's going to send you a nice thank you for that later, Paul. Oh, I love it. I love it. Absolutely love it. Bill Murray. Ghostbusters. Absolutely. Logan Pack. That is cool, man. Thank you so much. Bill Murray. Dracula. That is cool. I want to say it is from Dirty Girl Pinko. And it is one of the original monsters, Dracula. Love that, man. Thank you. That is awesome. And I don't know who this next person is, but he's got Evil Eye. And it's a special edition pen. There's only 500 made. Oh, this is a show I don't watch, but Sarah loves this show, so I'm sure she's going to know who this is. It's from Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Brian Romero is the artist of the pen. I don't care who the numbers are. They're never going to leave my hands, so they're mine. Thank you, Paul, so much. Favorite item of the box was this pin so so far. A 
anyone that knows me closely knows that I am a Joker and anything Pennywise fan. So, that is absolutely amazing. Thank you so much for that. Love that pen. I haven't had a set of these since middle school. We got a set of Batman trading cards, man. Not gonna chew the gum. Feels like there's gum in there. And I don't want to open it either. I think this is gonna stay sealed just in that pack, and we'll have that forever. Thank you so much, man. Well, who does not remember that set of eyeballs? Elvira. Mistress of the Dark by Dynamite Cards. Oh, and it's a BAM. Okay. It's a BAM card. That is awesome. Elvira, Mistress of the Dark. Who don't remember her, man? That is great. Thank you so much for that. Okay. Is that paper? Paper. More paper. Oh. Empty box. Are you kidding me, Paul? Are you serious right now, dude? Oh my god. I have to go frame shopping. All right. <laughs> Thank you so much, man. This is awesome. We're going to be here for just a second cuz we got to go through all of these and see what we have. First, I'll let you guys see it first. This is fan art Exorcist the VHS edition. That is awesome. Linda Blair. Yep, that is sweet. Oh, that is so badass. Thank you so much, dude. That is cool. Set that one over there. Alright, what is next? Oh, we also got the variant. Paul, man, thank you so much. I was literally just trolling through the community looking at all of this the other day thinking oh my god I'm going to be hunting for this stuff forever this is an awesome way to start man thank you so much the variant and the regular both autographed I couldn't be happier man that is just amazing thank you so much dude alright next this BAM Horror Box fan art collection art print Michael has been hand signed by artist Lab Creature for the one year anniversary box. Oh, I remember seeing this. That is awesome. I like it when it's not too serious all the time. So that is really badass. At least in my eyes, I think it's really cool. At least it won't be so terrifying to my grandkids when they walk into the office. Oh, it's yeah, it's autographed too. That is cool. 415 of 2000. And we also got the variant of that one. So I won't have to hunt those down either. Paul, you are amazing, dude. Thank you so much, brother. That is awesome, man. 30 of 500. That is a great number. Oh. That is amazing. And. Oh, this is an autograph. Hand signed by Keelan Golf, Who voices Freddy in Five Nights at Freddy. Really? 
Oh, that is so cool. God, that glare is awful. There is a glare. I am so sorry. That is awesome. I love that. That is like the bear of your nightmares. Yeah, there you go. You can see it that way. It's not coming out of the package, so that's the best way you guys are going to see it. Sorry. We're just getting started with this stack, so. Next, we have this 8x10 BAM original photo has been hand-signed by Dean Backer, who plays Squeak in basketball. It was signed during a private signing with the BAM box. Is it upside down? No, it's not. From basketball, squeak. That is cool. <laughs> that is awesome, man. Wow, it just keeps getting better and better. This BAM original box fan art collection is Things Are Getting Strange from Logan Peck. That is awesome. Stranger Things. Yeah. Stranger Things. That is awesome. So. That is cool. Sarah's going to love that. She's our Stranger Things. She likes that one. That is awesome, man. Okay, next. I already peaked. So, this this is... Oh, this. This BAM original fan art collection art print, Maximum Carnage, has been hand-signed by artist Brett Waldell and is guaranteed to be, guaranteed to be authentic. Carnage. That is going to get framed immediately. Love that, man. That is cool. Thank you so much. Number 524 of 2500. That is cool. Thank you so much, man. That may be my favorite so far. This band box has obtained this item personally or through a trusted partner in the industry and is guaranteed to be, guaranteed to be authentic. Oh, I was hoping to see this at some point. That is awesome. It's Zombie Negan. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. With loose seals there behind him. That is cool. Oh, and it's autographed. That is cool. 539-2500. I love some of these that aren't completely just hardcore gore some of them are a little softer and I don't mind that so thank you very much for that and this one I don't know it has a certificate of authenticity and what is that Bar. That is awesome. I have no idea what it is, but it is awesome. Somebody down below, leave me a comment. Tell me what that is. <laughs> that is cool. Freaky as hell. Number 15 out of 2000. That's cool. Thanks, bro. That's cool as hell. We're still going. This band with exclusive War of the Worlds. Chris by artist Chris Garofalo. Oh, yes, I've seen that one. Wait, is that upside down? No. War of the Worlds. That is cool. Let's 
seventy or three three thousand HG wells. That is awesome, man. Oh no way. If this is what I think it is, man, this is like insane. This BAM box fan art collection art print Joker has been hand signed by artist Chris Ecto and is guaranteed to be authentic. Oh, I love it. I seen this in the community and was planning on hunting it down. That is amazing. Absolutely love that. Joker 100%. Thank you so much, brother. Oh, that is cool. Wow. That is awesome. Oh, we're at the 21 minute mark. We better get through these, huh? I actually seen this one in the com in in the community, and Sarah is absolutely gonna love to have this in her office, and she is going to be very happy with it. It's the Wolverine print as a kitty, and if you don't like that, something's wrong with you. You need a heart, because that's just cool. Thanks, man. Sarah's going to love that. That is cool. <laughs> All right, and this is our last one. And the last piece in that very, very stuffed box full. Oh, thank you so much, man. Thank you so much. This is so cool. I'm going to take a look at this. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So this is, okay, we got the variant of the Wolverine as a kitty. That is cool. So we got both of those too. So we got a few sets in there to start us off in this collection, man. Thank you so much, Paul, for everything. We could not be happier with everything you've done for us since we became customers of the BAM box and... You invited us into this community. You guys have been absolutely great. And I won't take any more of your time up today. I just wanted to put this video out there to say thank you. Because not enough people do do that. And say thank you every once in a while. So from the bottom of my heart. And from Sarah. Thank you so much for the starter box. You kick ass brother. Keep doing what you do. Love you peep geek.